What do 90% of homeless and runaway children, 85% of children with behavioral disorders, 71% of high school dropouts, 75% of youth in drug abuse centers, and 85% of all youth in prison have in common? They all come from fatherless homes. There are over 25 million kids right now growing up in a home without their dad. And for them, Father's Day is just another fatherless day. But it doesn't have to be this way. The numbers show that children with involved fathers have higher self-esteem, better grade point averages, and they grow up to become the most compassionate adults. Dads, we are vital. The role we play is world changing. God has given us the ability to completely rewrite the future, not only for our sons and daughters, but for the millions of girls and boys who are right now living without a dad. Now is the time to step up. Our kids need us more than ever. The fatherless need us more than ever. There are kids in this building right now who need a man of God in their lives, a role model, a mentor, someone to say, I'm proud of you, someone to have their back, someone to affirm them, someone to show the love of Christ to them. Not just anyone, not just a friend. They need a man. So to all the dads out there, reflecting Jesus to their kids, willing to stand up for the abandoned and giving it all for their family. We say thank you. God is changing the world through you. Your impact will reach further than you can ever imagine. So be watchful. Stand firm in the faith. Act like men. Be strong. Let all that you do be done in love. Happy Father's Day. My dad is not mean. He's nice. My dad lets me go to the movies with him. His weapons are never hard. The thing I appreciate about my dad the most is his hardworking drive and loving attitude. What I appreciate the most about my dad is how he takes care of me and my mom. And also the time he spends with me. I'm happy the most when he, we are just hanging out and the meals going skateboarding. He's, he's one of a kind and my best friend. Love you, Dad. Happy Father's Day. My dad is funny, loving, kind, supportive, and caring. Happy Father's, Father's Day, Day, Dad. We love you. One thing that I appreciate most about my dad is that he is always taking care of his family. Throughout my whole life, I've never known him to put anything else before his family. And that's one thing that I hope to take on to my family in the future to always be about my family. The thing I appreciate the most about my dad is his strength. I love the fact that he can take care of all his kids inside the house and outside of the house all over the world. Um, I really appreciate that he can always switch hats. I love you, Dad. Happy Father's Day. What I appreciate most about my dad is that he is a man of God. He is kind, loving, understanding, and there for me when I need him. Most of all, he is an awesome father. I wouldn't have asked for a better father in the world. Happy Father's Day, Daddy. I love you. What I appreciate most about my dad is his wisdom, his patience, oh, thank you, Jesus, um, his work ethic, and his unfailing love and support. Oh, and he's the ultimate handyman. He can fix anything. Love you, Daddy. What we most appreciate about our dad, Deacon Pointer, is he's a protector, provider, passionate, and, and most, most of, of all, all a praying, praying man of God. Happy, Happy Father's Day. The thing that I appreciate the most about my father is um, that he loved his family and that he loved his wife. There was literally nothing that he wouldn't do for his wife and his kids. And I hope that one day when I have kids and when I get married, that I will uh, take that with me. Hello, this is Bishop Larry J. Baylor, and on behalf of all the brothers of Faith Miracle Temple and men at large taking charge, we'd like to wish all the men and fathers of Faith Miracle Temple a wonderful Father's Day. We thank God for all of the contributions that you make. God bless you. Have a wonderful Father's Day. <laughs>